What up, Del? And welcome back to Rio's Reactions. So today is Saturday, Saturday, November the 14th, 2020. And these are my first reactions since the motherfucking presidential nomination. And thank God we got Trump the fuck up out of here so we can start handling this motherfucking coronavirus, yo. Yesterday we had 184,000 new motherfucking cases. Ain't that a bitch. Um, we up to like 10,777,758 cases. 244,448 deaths. Shit is wicked in these mean streets, B. Mask the fuck up and stay away from niggas. Now, getting on to this request. Now, I have this request being from, uh, what is it? Gunny, wait, Gunnogany. But like I said on the other one, the uh, Crooklyn Dodgers 1994, several other motherfuckers requested this joint. I just didn't feel like looking through all my motherfucking notes to find out who you are. So shout out to your asses too. And if you are one of those people, hit a nigga up in the comments so I can do your shout out proper. Now, moving on. This is Crooklyn Dodgers, 1995. Actually, return of the Crooklyn Dodgers. Because the first one was Special Ed, Master Ace, and Buckshot Shorty. This one and that one was produced by none other than Q-Tip. So this one is the goat of all production hip-hop producers. The one and only DJ motherfucking Premier, Chub Rock, legend in his own right, OC, digging in the crates legend, uh, and J. Rue, the motherfucking damager. Mr. Heads up, because I'm dropping some shit himself. The bitches. I mean, this nigga got bangers. I just haven't done them yet. So, uh, this one, this was off the Clocker soundtrack. Another Spike Lee joint, yo. That's what he called this movie. It's the Spike Lee joint. Um, so this was from 1995, and this was with the boy Makai Pfeiffer, if I'm not mistaken. It was Makai Pfeiffer, right? Um, and, it, and the nigga, I forget, what was that nigga's name? I forgot that nigga's name. But the nigga drank you who all day and had motherfucking stomach aches and, uh, and wore uh, overalls with Timberlands on. I ain't never seen no nigga in New York dressed like that, dog. And that nigga looks off and stuff. But anyway, dog, I ain't here to shit on the motherfucking movie. I ain't like that movie. Um, so let's get to this motherfucking request, yo. Crooklyn Dodgers, 1995, uh, uh, volume two, I guess we could call it that, with DJ, produced by DJ Premier Chub Rock. Uh, featuring Chub Rock, OC, and J. Ruta Damage. And let's go. Return of the Crooklyn Dodgers, 1995. Look at this nigga's outfit, son. What'd I tell you? This nigga looked like a bitch. Like... <laughs> You better have a big ass gun. You come out dressed like that. He looked like a motherfucking one of them like horror films when they be out in the country and a redneck come out from behind the, under the car or some shit like that with some oily as oil stained coveralls and shit on. But this nigga in the motherfucker in the middle of a project in Brooklyn. I read some shit. I was watching a Glaze video and they was talking about this and I think they said this is like Sutter houses or some shit like that. But anyway, man, I just had to clown this whole ass nigga. We did it like that, and now we do it like this. We did it like that, and now we do it like this. <laughs> yeah. Now block kids. Chub Rock. The cocaine. Don't tell me it's the little kids on the boat train. The metaphor says from my brain to my jaw. It comes from other places. Not the tinted faces. Journalistic volumes are yellow, and then of course walkers. You watch Channel Zero with that bitch by the altars. You have your Damn! Damn! Ah, man! God 
damn it, Chubb Brock, I wasn't be trying to be intellectual today. Man, I forget this nigga got like a PhD and shit. This nigga smart as hell, dog. I think this nigga stopped rapping to get a PhD. Like, is he a doctor? Or he just one of them smart ass niggas with a PhD that teach like master's classes and shit. Either way, this nigga smart as a motherfucker and he just dropped some shit. He say like they did to Kennedy in 63, like they did it with, to Kennedy with the double cross and blew his fucking head off. God damn. Yo, we ain't about to get into the Kennedy conspiracy on this motherfucking platform, but yo, I'm fucking with you on that, Chubb. And he says some other shit about uh, Barbara Walters, Walters trying to promote like niggas from Vin and Crack. Bitch, he saying like, bitch, how the crack get here? How the cocaine get here? Niggas ain't got no motherfucking jumbo jets. That shit come from Nicaragua, bitch. Niggas, <laughs> niggas ain't even leaving the neighborhood. How the fuck they getting cocaine shipped in from motherfucking all over the world? Shut the fuck up with that bullshit. So that's the kind of shit my nigga Chubb on. So y'all, hopefully this. Oh shit, Jay, we on this motherfucker too. We gonna have to think again at the end. OC gonna give us a break on all that intellectual shit. But let me run this shit back, man. Chubb is dropping gems on you niggas. Let's go. Never taking shorts because Brooklyn's the borrow. We did it like that and now we do it like this. We did it like that and now we do it like this. <laughs> yeah. said Vietnam vets come back looking like one arm pets. God damn. Whew, you can't even rap like this no more. You, you lose all your fan base. <laughs> Motherfucking camera on the screen. This nigga got I got the screw face off this off this nigga fucking uh lyrics, yo. This nigga got me mad militant right now. KRS1 must have loved this shit. Let's take a second, think back, think back. Brooklyn, travel and distance the party, Brooklyn. Absolute functions that hardly Brooklyn. The name alone holds godly. You don't know, you better ask somebody. Talking about 
how ill the streets is in Brooklyn back then. He talked a lot of stick up kid shit. Talked about the Latin Quarter. He dropped that shit was just dope. He was just kicking some dope shit. His shit wasn't like super political like uh like like Chubbs, but that shit was dope too. I'm gonna just run it back right quick. Uh okay, let's go. Take a sec to think back, think back. Brooklyn, traveling distance to party. Brooklyn, absolute functions, not hardly. Brooklyn, the name alone holds godly. You don't know, you better ask somebody. Blackfield Street since 85. The beast getting paid to not bust. Hookers, drawers, got bust. Glass clapping regular. Hardcore niggas with fat gold chains. On the corner maintaining. Gold teeth flashes. Dig up kids playing in front of. Latin quarters, keep holding the daughters. Cause if bullets fly, watch the flaming. Another stain on the sidewalk. Yeah, he talking that street shit. He talking him. He talking that everyday street shit. That crack selling, that gun busting, the stick up kids, and all that shit. I was trying to get back to that shirt, but I can't get it. Fuck it. There it is. Back then you were silly if you had a gun. Sisters back then you were silly if you had a gun. People dashing, flashing, damn no fun. Old square, you couldn't shop too much. Cause four three were in your record. Fuck on up, you had you or die. East New York mad hell. Fellas cutting school, trooping the all go Maxwell. So many memories I can't manifest your roof. Stop where I finish it to Brooklyn, God bless. God bless. God bless. God bless. You represent. A young DJ Premier. Crazy ass Brooklyn because it is the Bible of the fittest. Crazy ass Brooklyn kid. Represent the Brooklyn all night. Crazy ass Brooklyn kid because it is the Bible of the fittest. Listen, cause for your mind, I got the right nutrition. We eat shit hard like fat asses in cases of Heineken. Here in Brooklyn, home of the warrior and villain. Trife type chicks, top villains. The anthem. Rasta the smoke, marijuana. the sip but then bullets hit brains when the lips start to sip Ooh. man I knew this nigga was gonna have me thinking about some shit god damn it for your mind I got the right nutrition. We keep you hard like fat asses and Heineken's. Is that what that nigga just said? Let me run it. My bad. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga say enterprise of men shoot dice on corners, nigga. <laughs> ah. Subliminal hypnotism and colonial colonialism keep brothers in prison. Ooh, god damn it. This nigga. Darren Brooklyn, home of the warrior and villain. Trife type chicks, top villains. The anthem. Rocks the smoke, marijuana. Enterprising businessmen shoot dice on the corner. Excuse me while I light my split, but some choose to sip so bullets hit brains. When bottles hit lips, clips, whatever happened. 
government issue, probably the same one that killed Noriega. Chips that power, nuclear bombs, power, my Sega. Subliminal hypnotism and colonialism leaves most niggas dead or in prison. Ooh. In Brooklyn, right hand cuts off the left hand to spite the hand, jealous of the next man. So violent crimes, black on black, plus mad crack the boot. Everybody can't rap, so most hustle and shoot. Make mm. money, money, get money, take money. I can't understand that concept, cause Jabu. Ja to 38 specials, now it's Desert Eagles Government issue, probably the same one that killed Noriega Chips that power, nuclear bombs, power, my Sega Subliminal hypnotism and colonialism Leaves most niggas dead or in prison In Brooklyn, right hand cuts off the left hand To spite the hand, jealous of the next man So violent crimes, black on black, plus mad crack the boot Everybody can't rap, so most hustle and shoot Make money, money, get money, take money I can't understand that concept, cause Ja rules everything around me Damn, this is why I don't do J Ru uh, reactions, dog. This nigga deep as fuck, son. Everything that nigga said was gospel, son. God damn. He talked about the crab and the barrel mentality, the right hand cutting off the left hand, even though the, they look that that hand looked the same as the other hand, because black people fucking over black people is basically what the nigga said. Like, God damn, this nigga, J. Root, every fucking song is a motherfucking uh, master's level uh, college college class, a uh, master's level lecture or some shit like that, yo. Like, this nigga's pen is ill. It's, this nigga's crazy with it, son. Businessmen shoot dice on the corner. Excuse me while I like my split, but some shoot the sip, so bullets hit brains. When bottles hit lips, clips, whatever happened to 38 specials. Now it's Desert Eagles. Government issue, probably the same one that killed Noriega. Chips that power, nuclear bombs, power, my Sega. Subliminal hypnotism and colonialism leaves most niggas dead or in prison. Mm. Brooklyn, right hand cuts off the left hand to spite the hand, jealous of the next man. So violent crimes, black on black, plus mad crack the boot. Everybody can't rap, so most hustle and shoot. Mm. Get money, money, get money, take money. I can't understand that concept, cause Ja rules everything around me. Fire burns the unjust like all. Hey, I ain't gonna go back, but that scene where Makai Pfeiffer come down the stairs and he grab the little nigga and throw him against the wall, that's him telling the little nigga to stay away from him because he know he fucked up. He know he ain't shit. And his mom's is on that nigga ass like, nigga, I'm gonna call the police. Nigga, stay the fuck away from my son. So... So, yo, that's Clockers, or I'm sorry, that's Crooklyn Dodgers 1995, yo. The return of the Crooklyn Dodgers, I should say, 1995. And that one was much better than the first one. Not only was the beat, I'm going to say the beats was, was equivalent. Like, they was both dope as a motherfucker, right? Um, but as far as the verses go, Chub Rock and J. Rue the Damager body that shit bodied it um on the first one uh my nigga special ed bodied it so if i had to rank them i would say j ruta damager chub rock special ed 
And then I would go OC, Master Ace. I'm going to say those niggas was about the equivalent. Because I like that last fucking Master Ace verse. So OC, Master Ace about time for the same. And unfortunately, Buckshot coming in, uh, bringing up the rear. But, yo, none of them was bad. I'm just putting them shits in the ranking. So that's it, man. Shout out to you, uh, Gunnel Ganey. And you three, you several other uh, mysterious mystery requesters who I don't remember who the fuck it was and didn't take the time to go back through the notes and find. So shout out to all you motherfuckers for this shit. So that's back to back Crooklyn Dodgers 1994 and then brought it back with Crooklyn Dodgers 1995, but two separate videos. I'm out. Crazy ass Brooklyn kids. <laughs>